crispy so crispy hot pepper again. I'm Chris Parks. Um, so I'm gonna try to go ahead and get through this um, um, as as quick as possible. Um, that way it doesn't um, kind of get into two parts like they've done uh, last time and then type of um, a couple times before that. Um, I got it in my Fuego box, my, uh, I believe it's my 10th one. Um, so I got two, two of them in today. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and get on this. Um, I got the Reaper Puree, uh, made with world's hottest pepper. Um, distributed by Pucker Butt Pepper Company. I love that name. Um, Pucker Butt. Mm, love it. Uh, this is, uh, made with peppers and vinegar. Uh, but look at that, it's a nice thick one. And then, let me go ahead and show it to you. Mm. That one actually looks like a really good one. Uh, and then we got uh, Ghost Scream Green Pep uh, Reaper Hot Sauce. Uh, it's uh, manufactured by Ghost Scream in San Clemente, California. Uh, so this one's... Um, you know, done here in, uh, in California. Um, the the level on this one is going to be a high one, so I'm actually really stoked for for this one. This one is a green. It's made with uh, tomatillos, green. Uh, um, it's green ghost peppers. Yeah. Oh no, green uh, reaper peppers, and then uh, fresh poblano peppers, lime juice, fresh garlic, fresh cilantro, salt, and spices. Um, so yeah, this one actually looks really interesting. I love it already. Uh, so let's go ahead and get going. I got my spoon, got my, um, stuff to go ahead and, um, kind of help with the palate cleansing. So again, you guys, um, like and share this, uh, get me out there. Um, kind of get these um, hot sauces out there as well um, and get more people kind of trying out hot if they like hot um, if you know of any challenges please let me know I've done the the death nut 2.0 I've done the um, the one chip challenge I've done the choco challenge um, so I've done quite a few of them I've even done the um, the one over at Buffalo Wild Wings on um, the um, you're forgetting what that one's called um but yeah i, I love doing challenges uh i love heat I, I find it a huge rush for me um and i also like the the taste and um just don't like the after effects um but love it uh so here it is there's the uh, that one's a nice thick one so already it's gonna be kind of like a uh, salsa verde um uh, that's actually that Actually smells a lot like salsa bread there. Uh, mm. You really get that tomatillo uh, taste to it. You, you can taste the serranos. Mm. Has a nice heat level. It has a really good kick in the mouth. Not too much so. But you can definitely taste the garlic. It's a little salty. It actually go good with some um, some carnitas. Um, maybe even some chicken, cooking them with the chicken over some eggs. Um, be actually nice with the, you add this to some green salsa, some salsa verde, just to kind of kick it up a notch if you want. That one's really good. Cleanse my palate. That way I can get that going. So, if you like heat and don't know how to kind of notch down or pretty much kick down the heat levels a little bit or kind of tame your mouth, um, to, you know, kind of uh, cool it down a little bit, best best things to do is use um, um, bread, uh, lemon juice, um, even, um, from my understanding, even sugar sometimes. Um, so, check it out. So again, guys, 
I do my own my own pepper mixes. I, I do about four different types of pepper, um, uh, along with some garlic powder. Um, so I'm I'm still learning here. Pretty soon I'm going to try. It. I'm also going to try out my own hot sauce. So be on the lookout for that. Whoa, that was going to be a kick in the ass. Actually, that thickness right there that reminds me of ooh, look at that. Uh, that kind of reminds me of the uh, the truff sauce. Oh wow! That's definitely a puree. Ooh, that's definitely kick in the mouth. Oh my gosh! That really is um, some. Um, that's that's straight. Pepper puree right there. Oh. That was a lot. It just came out. Woo. That's a really good kick in the mouth right there. Um, heat level rise. You can really taste the pepper. You can kind of taste the vinegar a little bit, but not too much. <coughs> So again, if you like this, so this right here, definitely put in some salsa if you want to kick it up. It's a straight puree. So you can add it to anything. Um, hot sauces, uh, salsas. Um, if you want to just kick up your eggs a super ton, you can go ahead and do that. Um, a little bit goes a long way. Whew. Alright guys, I'm going to call it. Thank you, thank you for watching. Like and share. Um, subscribe. Um, send me uh, some challenges. Um, again, I've done uh, the Death Knight Choco Challenge, One Chip Challenge. Um, so yeah, until next time, you guys have a good one.